Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Today we're at the Greenock Cat and we're just going to have a little look around and explore the area. Hi guys, I'm Sean Brett and this is my travel life. I'm currently travelling in Scotland and it is amazing. So we got recommended this place after someone watched our video on the Wangi and um, this is the area that we got recommended. It's the Greenock Cut and it's full of waterfalls and old people, yes. We are the youngest people here by about 40 years. But that doesn't mean it's not going to be a good place, guys. It might be a bit of an easier walk. If you guys are looking for an easy walk in Scotland, this may be the place for you. But we don't know. We'll find out for you in a second. The car park is literally just up this hill up here. And it's a five minute walk to this waterfall that we're just about to have a look at now. So we just saw the waterfall and that's kind of uh, it, isn't it? Let's go home. <laughs> <laughs> now we're just gonna have a look around and see what other things there is around here. There's so many different walking routes you can take. So if we're just following the one that we're going from the waterfall. On the way back, we will definitely go past the uh, lock. Lock, where's the lock here? Form. Lock form? Form. 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 Yeah, we'll go past the lock and we'll show you that as well. We'll take some shots of the lock. But we're just gonna go for a walk. It's quite a flat walk so far and just, Take a chilled walk next to the river. Not Tom. Yeah, it's got an H on it, that's Tom. That's Tom. <laughs> okay, so the whole walk is 10K. And um, as much as this is flat and relaxing, I do not feel like a 10K walk today. So we're gonna- we're Yeah, we're on a 60 hour week at the moment. <laughs> and we're looking at going away on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yep. So we'll probably have a look at tonight and see where we can go. <laughs> Are you apologising to your dad? Shh. I'm meant to have fans, all right? Ah, the pebble on my shoe. Yeah, it's karma. Um, <laughs> someone recommended it. It wasn't your dad. It was one of my YouTube fans. All right, okay. Um, <laughs> so it's a 10k walk. So we're not going to do that, but we are going to carry on walking down here because apparently there's a viewing spot of some sort. <laughs> How did it get in my shoe? I don't know. Where the boots? It's right. Oh God. It's like right in the crevice of my toe. Imagine doing a 10k walk with this one. Um, <laughs> I'm not to do it than you are. Um, anyway, we're gonna have a look down here, and then we're gonna show you some shots on the way back. I'll we'll drive. The pretty trees that Sean being annoying. I'll drive back. Good. Can I not explain anything to these people? No. I'm going to drive back and get you some video clips of the lock. Tom. Tom. Yeah. She's always on her camera. You can't get away from her. Yeah. Is that an unsmiley face on that tree? That's really creepy. Oh, oh creepy. Oh, someone's. That's super creepy. What's the matter, Holly? There's a pebble in my foot. Oh, there's a pebble in your foot, is there? Uh -huh. Is it annoying? Oh, I don't think I'm skinny enough for this. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's what you get. <laughs> Neither am I. Actually, to be fair, this is pretty incredible. Yeah, we're flying from over from here. Okay. What, flying my drive from here? Yeah. Uh, Out, over, like, just... Right. See? So, my, uh -huh. Me have a go at me, but I have an eye for shots. My director's telling me that I need to fly my drone over here. Okay. Just go and hit the geese, or do. Oh Maybe. no, they will take my drone down. Uh, they're from Canada, they're polite, they'll, they'll apologise when they do it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
So that was about a 10 minute walk, you say? Yeah, it wasn't far, we walked. Yeah. We're about a 10 minute walk to that area. I'm gonna head back now and then go over to Lock Tom. I'll probably drive my car because I am lazy. <laughs> So as you can see up there, there's a little cafe as well. So if you guys are interested in a cafe just nearby this walk, then there's a cafe here. But for us, we're gonna take a car journey a bit further down to Largs and get a fish and chips. But first, let's show you Lock Tom. Okay, it might be a bit weird to film the toilets, but there is some great advice in the toilets. So there you go. So there's this on the wall right here. Um, as you see, it's got all the walks and information, times that the the visit center's open, there's a QR code and everything. And it's impossible to miss, unless you're me, because it's on the wall of the visit center right next to the cars. There's so many beautiful walks you can take, but for me, I just took my car down here, have a look at the lock. off right now and show you one of the best rated fish and chips in the whole of Scotland down in Largs. So I was just driving down the road to Largs and I was like damn I need to stop. I need to have a look at this because this looks amazing. So I'm just gonna quickly run back so you can see what I saw when I was driving down the road. So imagine this you're driving down the road right now and like boom look at this. That looks pretty cool. So cool, because in the background, like as much as I'm zoomed in right now, you can see just like general stuff. Just looks nice. There you go, guys. It's just another little hidden gem while you're down here. So don't miss that, because that is pretty cool. Alan! <laughs> Alan! I can't see you, and Alan! <laughs> Alan! Oh no, that, that's Steve. Steve! Steve! Actually, I think it is Alan. So this is Largs. It's a seaside town on the west coast of Scotland. And uh, this here is Nadini's Cafe. It's a world famous ice cream parlor. Well, it's pretty good over here. There's 150 different ice creams. Yeah. Um, anyway, it's way too cold for an ice cream today, but we're just got here to show you around just a couple of things before we get our fish and chips. This isn't the best beach in Scotland, but it does have some incredible views from the beach. That's Cumbie over there. That's what over there? Cumbie. Cumbie? Yeah. Well. Oh nice. So um, do you want to tell us the news? Is it open? Oh, <laughs> Look at all the awards this fish and chips has got. Oh no, I think it It is open. Just not the cafe. Awesome, so this is the fish and chip shop. It's called the Fish Works. Um, it has many awards but we're with the judge today About 10 minutes 10 minutes well you got squid yeah 10 a, minutes a squid, never a squid supper squid supper <laughs> so i went for five quid squid <laughs> which was seven, which was seven pound fifty because i went for the full works what did you go for haddock haddock uh, and chips and we went with the uh, famous Iron Brew, and I went with a Lemon Fanta. Time for the big reveal, guys. This is yours. This is mine. Five pounds. Holy. Five quid, good. Woohoo! 
That's which a, was seven pound fifty because they come with chips. That's a lot of squid. Though. That is a lot of squid. Next up is the haddock. Oh my! God. That's <laughs> my, look at my hand. <laughs> my hands are big, guys. Look how much chips. Are there. That's massive. That is so good. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of our journeys, then make sure you subscribe because we go on random trips. I mean random trips, like we're gonna book a three day trip away somewhere tonight and we don't have a clue where it is. And it is in four or five days time we're going on this trip. Mm. So it's gonna be mad. So make sure you subscribe and keep up with us because this is my travel life. And I will see you again soon.